hey there, this is Joystick News. Today we dive in headfirst into the world of Prince of Persia, the lost crown. And let me tell you, it's a wild ride. Buckle up because we're about to spill some major spoilers. If you haven't played the game yet and want to keep the surprise fresh, now the time to pause this video and come back later. You've been warned. Before we jump into the heart of the lost crowd, let's talk about meta humor in gaming. Remember Deadpool? Yeah, the gay who broke the fourth wall like it was made of sugar glass. That's where mainstream meta humor really took off. It's not just about cracking jokes, it's about being self-aware, giving a cheeky note to the audience that, hey, we know you there and we, you know, the joke together. Now, Prince of Persia The Lost Crown isn't trying to be a Deadpool clone. This game has that, weaving a story of betrayal, power struggles, and the classic hero journey. But here is the kicker. Amid this epic tale, the game winks at its player, offering that sprinkle of light, heartedness we didn't know we needed. Let's zoom in on the smirk. The mythical bird is no ordinary creature. It's a symbol, a powerful entity that's central to the game plot. But here is where it gets interesting. As we reach the climax, there is this line. Trish, I have seen the universe born. Could this be a subtle jab at the series itself? Would it serve reboot and transformation? If so, that's some clever writing. Prince of Persia has indeed seen its fair share of rebirths from the sand of time to the last crown. Each one brought something new to the table. And if we read between the lines, the smirk's message about light and darkness might be more than just fancy dialogue. It's like the game is saying, hey, we had our ups and downs, but each step was necessary. It's hopeful. Take on the franchise journey, acknowledging the past while looking forward to the future. In conclusion, Prince of Persia The Lost Crown isn't just another chapter in a long-running series. It's a reflection of the series itself, a mere commentary on its own legacy. It's a game that's know where it's been and isn't afraid to book a bit of fun and at itself while delivering a gripping narrative. And that's what makes it special. It's not just about the action and the adventure. It's about being part of a legacy, a story that's been told and retold each time with a new twist. The Lost Crown honor its roots while charting its own course. And that's something worth celebrating. So, what do you think? Is Prince of Persia The Lost Crown a clever nod to its own history? Or are we reading too much into it? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe for more gaming insights and news. Until next time, keep gaming and keep exploring those hidden that. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that bell icon to stay updated with Joystick News. Check out our other videos. Thank you so much.